Let us construct a pentagon inscribed in a circle. First step, we will draw the diameter of the circle. So we have a diameter. And then we will like to draw the perpendicular to the diameter of the circle. In order to draw perpendicular, we take a compass and draw a circular arc. Maintaining the center to be one endpoint of the diameter. So by we draw two circular arc from two endpoint of the diameter. Those circular arc intersect at some point. We join that point with the center of the circle. So we have a perpendicular to the diameter of the circle. We change the radius of the compass so that radius of the compass is equal to radius of circle. And then we draw two circular arc. So the radius of the compass is equal to radius of the circle. Those circular arc will once again intersect the circle. Let us join the intersection point by a straight line. So what we have is a chord. Let us join midpoint of the chord with the end point of the first diameter that we have drawn. We get a straight line. Once again, we take a compass. We change the radius of the compass so that the radius is exactly equal to the length of the straight line that we have taken. The radius is exactly equal to length of the straight line that we have taken. And we draw a circular arc. The circular arc will intersect the perpendicular that we have drawn and the endpoint of the diameter that we have drawn. Let us join the endpoint of the diameter to the intersection point of the perpendicular and the circular arc. Once again, we get a straight line. Once again, we change the radius of the compass and we change the radius of the compass. Radius is exactly equal to length of straight line that we have drawn for the last time. And we draw a circular arc. The arc will intersect the circle at some point. The arc will intersect the circle at some other point. The arc will intersect the circle at some point and other point. We change the center of the compass and again draw two circular arc. We change the center of the compass and draw two circular arc. In total, we have drawn four circular arc. One, two, three, fourth. Let's draw the fifth one as well. The five circular arc intersect the circle at five different points. Let us join those points. Let's use red color for that. One line, two line, three line, four line, and five line. The five line segment that we have drawn gives us a pentagon. Not just a pentagon, but we get a regular pentagon. So we have circumscribed a pentagon inside a circle.